Hello and welcome back <sighs> to the basically the top of the North Crater. So, you know when I said that I didn't that there wasn't any materia here. Turns out I wasn't exactly tr that wasn't exactly true. Now, in defense of my previous self, it was 100% listed on my notes that it was, was in fact, here. Um... Unfortunately, my present self failed to actually read the damn list. <laughs> so, you know, the best notes in the world won't help if you don't actually read them. Uh, yeah. So, that HP absorb would be really good on Nights of the Round. Unfortunately, I think Magic Plus is actually more valuable in this instance. So, oh well, I guess. Also, um, okay, that leveled up, I just wanted to see what the progress was like. So, uh, on that note, I'll meet you back down at the bottom of the freaking maze. Uh, see you in a few minutes. Okay, we're here. Now, I believe... Yeah, just down we go. Okay, I was right. This is... This is where I thought. So, first of all, first thing to mention, this seems like a good place to use your save crystal. Do not use your save crystal on this screen. This is one of the areas where... It will totally fuck up your game if you use your save crystal here. So, you know, don't. Uh huh. Wait, what? Oh, I may have fucked up a little bit. Well, it's not the end of the world, but. Man, that sucks. Okay. Oh no. No, we're still good. Okay. There, we'll go left. Tifa. We need... Where is it? We need Tifa to go right. And we need Red and Yuffie to go left. The other characters don't really matter. Uh, Katie, Vincent, Sid, and Barrett. Uh, incidentally, those four, those four are the, are the ones who are going to be composing our party for this next section. Um, obviously, I'm not going to use Katie. I'm going to use Barrett and probably Sid. Because Sid can do Tifa. Sid can basically do the same job as Tifa. Um, whereas Vincent could probably do that, but he would need a more specialized uh, material setup. Materia Hunter Yuffie. Sounds like the last chapter of Materia Forever. What? Whatever. All life on this planet. Indeed, life of this very planet is in our hands. I'm so happy to have met you all, really. And Tifa's literally all alone going right. <laughs> oh, that's terrific. Yep, let's. Now, I really wish I could save here. Because there are no save points in the Northern Crater, except for that one. Uh, oh hey, look at that. Uh, Spirit Lance, uh, need, you need a better armor. Oh, I have a Mistile. I mean, really, someone should have this on. 
Um, it's lower defense, but that evasion is really amazing. So... Hmm. Yeah... Okay, you get the Imperial Guard. Because I need the Escort Guard for... for Sid here. And you can have a... Tetra Elemental. Okay, that's a little bit redundant. Whatever. Um... We are going to take Tifa's stuff. Oh. Oh! I've done a whoopsie. Hmm. Maybe it's been dumped into my inventory then? Okay, it's been dumped in my inventory. Whew! I was worried there for a second. Okay, so, nice of the round, magic plus, bomb at zero. Uh, Phoenix. W summon. Enemy skill, the one with stuff on it, of course. Uh, Bomb at zero gets Quadra Magic. Uh, Phoenix needs to go here, actually, do this final attack. Because out of effect with Hades. And that's all, all of them. Okay then. So, we went left. We need to go left because there's another fork here. Uh, incidentally. You, you pretty much must go left, because you want to be able to direct people on this fork. Um, okay, so, we want... Where is the damn... We want Yuffie and Red to go up. So really, we're gonna have everyone but our three-person party go up. There we go. Do you really need to say another speech? <laughs> that was pretty different from the first one. Hmm. I wonder if you can save Crystal on this screen. That might be worth that might be worth checking out. Because I know in the go up route, that is another error. Look, we'll see it eventually. So, just anyway. We're going this way for now. It's a box! It's a remedy. Okay, so. We're looking for two materia in this area. And we don't really care- I don't really care about anything else. Uh, oh! Okay, no, I stand corrected, I care about that. That's a- that's a scary. Also, let's check out some level 4 limit breaks. Um, is that, that's based on kills, right? Honestly, that wasn't as bad as I was expecting. Hmm. Also, interesting that it did not counterattack the limit break. Couldn't say. Uh, well. Doesn't counterattack it. No, that was an ad attack. It didn't counterattack it, though, that's the important thing. I'm not, sure, I'm not sure how the high wind has reached us down here, but you know, whatever. Oh no, there we go. 
Yeah, totally counterattack. I think Sid has way fewer kills than Cloud, though, so he should be fine. I just, I just don't want, I just don't want to get knifed, okay? Surely this will kill it. I actually ran into one of these on my way up to the materia at the start. Although, to be honest, I ran away from that one. Okay, yeah, that, that did it. Great. Okay, let's do that. And let's get that box. There we go. It is... an elixir. I mean, don't get me wrong, elixirs are really useful. But not really what I'm after. What the hell is that? Armored Golem. Eh, it wasn't so bad. Not a lot, of, a lot of limit gauge into Sid, though. Hmm. You know, it occurs to me, I've not been stealing from anything down here. Truth be told, that's one thing that I might have slacked on a little bit with my notes. I... I do know what... I, I have like, two different things written down that I can steal elixirs from, but other than that... Also, did I just get the Mecha All? I wasn't paying attention, but I'm pretty sure that was one of the things I was looking for. Also, I'm pretty sure the Death Eye here can inflict instant death. Just throwing that one out there. Okay, um... No, Materia. Uh... It should be... No? I didn't get Mega All? I could've sworn... It must have been like a Mega Lexer then. I just saw Mega when I opened that box. And obviously I wasn't paying close attention. I mean, I already said as much, but... Right. You know, I'm just gonna run away from you. I honestly don't think you're worth fighting. And you'll become increasingly less worth fighting as I fight you more. And Cloud has killed more things. Okay, um, can I actually run away now? Thank you. I don't expect I'll run away from anything else, but... Man. Oh, I see you! I see you there. Can I? No, I can't. Oh, there we go. Magic counter! Which does pretty much what you would prob- It does what you would probably guess. When you get hit, the magic or summon that is attached to magic counter will be cast. As long as you have the MP to cast it. Oh, well, okay then. I mean, I have to open the box. It's probably not the Mega All, since I've already talked about that one. I mean, I may as well just keep saying it. But. But it may be something similar. Or, no, that's definitely not true. But it might be like a Megalexer or something. There we go. Takes a while, but Tone Bears don't do anything for forever. Oh, I can go through here. Neat. It's just a vaccine. Okay, well that's a little bit underwhelming, I'll be honest. I didn't even realize that connected. I didn't even need to go back up here. I mean, it's faster this time, I think, but... 
Well, maybe. Presu it is if I can get back down anyway. <laughs> There's a whole lot of tone barriers, I see. Huh. Worth mentioning, you actually do fi- Oh! Hey! I didn't notice that before. I've been totally fighting those things the whole time. Damn it. Well, it says it's not on this path, though, so it must have been some. Sorry, I'm getting sidetracked. I'm looking at my notes, specifically at the enemy skills section. Um. It must have been something else, then. That just had a similar name. X Potion, that's nice. Because there's different. As I was saying, there's different enemies in each of the paths, and I believe there's enemy skills we want in all three. Possibly not this one, uh, but definitely in the other two. Kill the Death Eye! A little bit faster, please. Thank you, Cloud. Thank you. So, um... Hmm. Right. So, obviously... Oh, hey, there's the Mega All. Oh, yeah, I guess I may as well grab this box as well. It's a Speed Source. Sure. See, uh, what? No, stop doing that! I guess I'll use the speed source first. Uh, there it is. Type, and battle. No, stop it! Huh. Okay, that... This is annoying. What the hell? What what the actual hell? Come seriously? I don't know if this is a control issue or if it's actually intended to do this. One second. So so it turns out they just sort of made this bullshit. You just sort of need to mash it until you get it. Which is incredibly stupid. There, got it! Why would they do that? That is so... That's gotta be unintentional. Anyway. Check out. Um... Mega All! I think I'll master this one first, but then we'll throw this on. Um, when it says all actions, it means all of them. Every spell... And even many, and even some regular actions, like, um, I don't think it overrides double cut, but it let, makes you, t it gives you a slash all effect as well, until it, it runs out. Um, yeah. Anyway, uh, we've gotten all of the items here. So now, what I'm gonna do is run back up. And take a different path. And in this way, we'll go down all three paths. And we'll get some duplicate items because of the characters we sent down the different paths. Which is the real trick here. Um, we'll get some, that we'll get some duplicates of items we otherwise would not have received. Incidentally, I was already saying, I already sort of mentioned this earlier, but if you, if you go right instead of left, the characters will always go down the same path on the left side. I don't remember if they go up or down, but they'll always take the same path. Anyway... Anyway... I will meet you back up at the intersection! See you in a sec! And we're back here. So. So. 
while I was looking up that Mega All bullshit, I also happened upon something else. As far as I know, this screen right here is safe to use our save crystal on. Inside Northern Cave. No, that's... I, I would could really use something more specific, to be honest. So, we're gonna use our save crystal here. Also, we're gonna use a tent. Uh, we have tents, right? Yes! Tent! And that is awesome! Check out our level name. Yeah, um... That's just great. Uh... We will definitely use a new save point. <laughs> just in case something terrible happens. That is awesome. Uh, and we'll go this way. Uh, is that a... That's clearly a Bahamut. King Bahamut. Okay, um... Manipulate is my seal, right? Maybe not. What did I pair steel with? Hmm. No, it must have been on Manipulate. But that totally didn't work. Man, I checked this ahead of time. I am positive Ma Manipulate is compatible with Steel as well, but it's clearly not working. Uh, that's annoying. Come to think of it, doesn't this guy cast Meteor when you kill him? Oh, I guess not. Okay then, works for me. Is there anything else I need to manipulate, actually? Um, I mean, yes, actually, there is. Damn it! But I want to be able to steal with someone. I mean, I guess I don't strictly need to, but it's sure as hell convenient being able to. I mean, well, hmm. Here's what it boils down to. I need elixirs for AP grinding. There's a lot of enemies down here you can steal elixirs from. If I was playing the PS version, I would just be able to use uh, w the uh, W item trick to duplicate my elixirs, but I'm not. Um, thus, steal power. This is supposed to work when paired with Pretty much any um, command materia, except for enemy skill, double cut, slash all, and steal. And maybe mine. But it's clearly not working with manipulate, which is frustrating. Or, or maybe it is and it just doesn't show it. I'd believe that. Not any W. I hmm. Okay. The list of things that doesn't work with is longer than I said. Still, it works with command materia, such as manipulate. What have I swapped? Morph does basically no damage, so it should be safe. And this way I still manipulate! Okay. Okay. I'm happy with this. Let's, let's keep going. Incidentally, speaking uh, oh, I've gone the wrong way. Incidentally, speak- well, actually, no, no, I will go this way. So never mind, hold that thought, I was gonna talk about the way we were going, but we're going this way instead. Uh, is- I'll s- oh. It won't let me? Wait, what? Seriously? Huh. Well, that's odd. Maybe they fixed it in the PC version so you can't do that anymore. Man, that would be lame. I want to duplicate myself some items. 
And frankly, I'll need to go back to those areas anyway for both enemy skills and the stuff that the party didn't loot. Because here's how it works. Um, after they come out the other side, side, there will be certain boxes and or materia which are no longer there because they looted them. Um, the items you get when we get to the bottom, each uh, party member that we send a different way will give us an item th that they got from the area they went into. Um, that item is not just doesn't just come out of nowhere. It's actually taken out of the area. However, it's not taken out of the area until they actually give it to us. Which is why we should be able to duplicate some items this way. Um, I'm not even sure what items exactly. Um, I didn't... I wrote down where to send my party members, but I didn't actually write down what items they gave me. Um, I knew my lot. I do, however, know my logic for the Barrett, Sid, Vincent, and Keats' one. Uh, basically, they don't give us anything good. Or, well, strictly speaking, I think I think had we gone a different route, Vincent gives us something good from this area. But we went this way, so it doesn't actually matter. Um, you don't get items from people who came along with you. So, I can't go- maybe they did fix that in the PC version. Or maybe I need to go a little bit further. One way or another, we'll figure it out. It's possible I've not fully min-maxed this shit. Or it's possible I could just, you know, go down- I mean, like, that's really what it boils down to. I need to backtrack in these areas anyway, for both for the items that the my party has not picked up, and also for enemy skills. I suppose I could have saved myself a little bit of time and not done this area. Because I could have definitely sent people to get the two things in this area, the Magic Counter and Mega All. And then just not bother backtracking here, because there aren't any enemy skills here. Mostly the enemies in this area we could have encountered earlier anyway. Mostly! I don't think the Evil Eye is anywhere else, but the Toneberry definitely was in the maze. Okay, so, what I think I, it might be, the thing that I'm going to try, is if I go into the end area, but I don't go all the way down, or maybe if I go up instead of down, hmm, what, what we'll see in any case. What, what, I have a save point, I'm reasonably confident I won't have to redo the no whole North Crater. And even if I do, and I really hope I don't, but even if I do, worst case, I've only lost about an hour, well, I've lost a little bit more than an hour of, of my, I haven't lost recordings. And it'll only cost me about an hour to redo the parts that I've already done. Although, admittedly, it'll probably come out at a lower level uh, than otherwise. So, if I go in this area... I want to be careful where I s Oh, it's a luck source. I don't even know what luck does in this game, to be honest. I type and battle. So, no, there's a big rock there. Okay, so... Here's what I'm going to try. Now that I'm on this screen, this is where I should meet up with everyone. So, it might have set a flag me coming here to enable me to go down the other routes. So I'm going to try that. 
And if it doesn't work, it's not the end of the world. We'll just, you know, we'll figure it out. Uh, having said that, I think I'm going to stop off here for now. Join me next time when we quite possibly finish exploring the northern crater. Until then, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy VII, and have a great day. Bye!